at the 30th Annual Academy Awards. Joanne Woodward. I can only say I, I've been daydreaming about this since I was nine years old. Thank you very much. In 1968, Paul Newman, famous in front of the motion picture cameras, undertook his first assignment behind them as director. Joanne Woodward, Mrs. Newman in private life, agreed to star for him. Paul Newman tells it. She's sitting on a set, and she appears to do absolutely nothing. But there's some strange motor going on in there that us fellas don't know anything about. Watching some of the things that she did, I literally would have to turn away from the camera because uh, it would get to me. Oh, those elegant sandwiches were simply delicious. So glad you enjoyed them. Enjoyed them. I'm not going to be able to haul myself out of this chair. I walked over to her and I said, what would you do? Show me. And she walked over and did what she did. And that was it. We printed the first take and I said, take a scene in the picture. Why didn't you get married like a normal woman and have children like your sister Stacy did? Any woman is unusual. Any woman is, is mysterious. They, at one instant, can be maddening. They can be enchanting. They can be uh, indecisive. They can be tough as nails. And that's really, to me, the mystery of, of Rachel, that she explodes one minute uh, in tears and the next minute in laughter. <laughs> the lady commands respect, and she gives respect. Uh, that she chooses this particular moment in her life to make some new evaluations and to take a step. Uh, that's really the strength of the picture. That's what Rachel is about. You hold on to me. I think you want to be willing, please. Please allow what you're feeling. <laughs> it's just such a new experience, having contact with anyone. I believe the Lord is here this very minute wanting to help us. Oh, please, Lord. Please free these people from all their suffering. 